Google Calendar is undoubtedly the most used calendar app out there. The main reason behind that, it is free, and it syncs properly with other Google productivity tools. But is it the best calendar app? Question remains, because you can't manage projects within it, the built-in task management isn't so intuitive, and there is no AI implication. Luckily, there are a bunch of great calendar apps out there that do more than just set reminders. In this video, we're going to show the best Google Calendar alternatives for different scenarios so that you can pick the right one for you. Fantastical. Is it too much to say Fantastical is fantastic? This calendar app has everything you could want. Great design, smart features, and it was Mac-focused initially, but now, it's even available on Windows. Most calendar apps throw a long list of calendars in the left panel, but Fantastical makes better use of that space with an agenda view and reminders. Another small but useful feature. If an event appears in two calendars, it only shows up once, with a subtle pinstripe pattern to let you know it's duplicated. One of the biggest reasons people love Fantastical is its natural language event creation. Just type something like Lunch with Jane tomorrow, and the app instantly fills in the details. Other apps have tried this, but Fantastical gets it right every time. It also syncs with pretty much every major calendar service, iCloud, Google, Exchange, Office 365, and more. So you don't have to worry about compatibility. And if you're scheduling meetings, it makes the process easier by integrating directly into your calendar. No extra tools needed. So in case you want a calendar that's easy to use and packed with useful features, Fantastical is worth checking out. If you've ever struggled with managing multiple schedules, you know how frustrating it can be. TeamUp Calendar can make that easier. It's a web-based scheduling tool that goes beyond simple event tracking. It helps teams organize everything in one place. Unlike Google Calendar, TeamUp is designed for more complex scheduling. The sub-calendar feature lets you create different categories under one master calendar, so you can track projects, team schedules, or shared resources without getting lost in overlapping events. It also comes with useful tools like custom fields for job details, task statuses for prioritizing work, and a table view that supports multiple choice fields for better organization. There's even a built-in system for tracking employee leave, which makes it easier to manage time off requests. That said, it doesn't offer strong tools for stakeholder communication, and its interface could use a refresh compared to Google Calendar's sleek design. But if you're looking for a calendar that actually helps you manage a team's schedule without the usual headaches, TeamUp Calendar is definitely a good one. Vimcol is one of the fastest calendar apps designed for busy professionals managing multiple meetings daily and need a way to manage them within seconds. Unlike traditional calendar apps, Vimcol streamlines scheduling with features like drag-and-drop meeting setup, natural language event creation, and instant meeting access. Instead of manually searching for a meeting link, users can press V to join their next meeting instantly. Vimcall's keyboard shortcuts allow users to quickly create events, switch between views, and navigate the calendar without excessive clicking. For Teams, Vimcall includes scheduling polls, executive assistant tools, and time zone tracking, which makes global collaboration easy. Users can set up one-click scheduling links, eliminating back-and-forth emails when booking meetings. Additionally, their event templates help save time by pre-filling details for recurring events. In fact, a built-in focus mode, inspired by the Pomodoro technique, encourages productivity by managing work intervals and breaks. Location-based scheduling allows users to quickly book meetings at nearby venues. Overall, if speed and efficiency matter, Vimcal is the one to go for. Notion has always been about keeping everything in one place, and now that includes a calendar. After acquiring Cron, Notion added a built-in scheduling tool that works right inside the platform. Whether you're on desktop or using Notion on the web, your calendar is now just a click away. 
It's got everything you'd expect. Month, week, and timeline views, two-way syncing with Google Calendar, and easy drag-and-drop scheduling. You can also set up recurring events and tasks, so you don't have to re-enter the same things over and over. What really makes it useful is how well it connects with the rest of Notion, just like Google's G Suite. You can link your calendar to existing Notion pages, which makes it easy to see upcoming meetings alongside your projects and notes. Though, it doesn't work with Outlook or iCloud yet. If you rely on those, you'll have to look elsewhere. But if you're already deep in the Notion ecosystem, this calendar fits right in. Zoho has a huge product lineup, and Zoho Calendar is one of them. It's got all the basics, reminders, task lists, and a built-in to-do list. Plus, it works smoothly with Zoho's other apps, Google Calendar and Outlook. One of its biggest advantages is the integration. Let's say you schedule a meeting in Zoho Calendar. That meeting will show up in Zoho Mail automatically. Or if you add a new contact in Zoho CRM, you can quickly schedule an event with them. It's small details like this that make the experience smoother, especially for teams working across multiple apps. Zoho Calendar also has some handy features. You can create public and group calendars to coordinate events, use SmartAd to quickly schedule something just by typing a sentence, track RSVP responses, and set up automatic reminders. If you need to share your calendar, you can even embed it into a website. However, it struggles with more complex scheduling needs and it might not be the most flexible option for certain projects. Still, if your team already uses Zoho products, this calendar makes a lot of sense. Nobody likes wasting time figuring out when to meet. Calendly takes care of that for you. Instead of sending emails back and forth to find a time, you set your availability, share your link, and let others pick a slot that's feasible for them. It connects with your calendar, Google, Outlook, iCal, so you don't have to worry about double booking. If you've already got something scheduled, Calendly makes sure no one books over it. It's flexible too. You can schedule one-on-one -on -one meetings, group sessions, or even webinars. You can also set buffer times between meetings, so you're not jumping from one call to the next with no break. Plus, it works with Zoom and other apps, so when someone books a meeting, Everything's set up automatically, so there are no extra steps. If you want a simple way to manage your schedule without all the back and forth, you should check out Calendly. Microsoft Outlook is one of the best alternatives to Google Calendar, and for good reason. When Microsoft acquired Sunrise Calendar, they took the best parts of it and integrated them into Outlook, which improved it over the years. The calendar works with both Outlook and Gmail accounts, and you can subscribe to other calendars online or by importing files. Because it's built into Microsoft 365, it connects easily with Microsoft Teams. It also supports Google Meet and Zoom, so scheduling video meetings is simple. Outlook also includes a feature that Google Calendar lacks, built-in sports and TV schedules. Users can track their favorite NFL team, Formula One races, or other sports leagues directly within the calendar. This makes it easy to stay updated without switching between multiple apps. Outlook has apps for every major platform, and it's free to use. If you're looking for a reliable, well-integrated calendar, Outlook is one of the best Google Calendar alternative. So that's all about the best Google Calendar alternatives. Let us know which one do you think might help you be productive in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe to get more videos like this.